Hello, hello, and welcome back. We are doing yet another home tour reaction video. The first one received such good feedback, uh, so I'm excited to keep this series going. Before we get started, I just wanna say, if you have been here multiple times and you have not yet hit the subscribe button, please hit the subscribe button. It helps our channel grow and gets more people involved in these fun conversations that we're gonna be having as we continue to dive into to these spaces we also have some really exciting content coming your way soon so yes please hit the subscribe button if you didn't know i also have a small home decor shop called sticky icky it is always linked in the description below please join in the conversation as we go through this reaction leave some comments down in the comment section let's talk about this space okay this time around we are doing what i think was the most requested home tour on the last home tour by the way if you haven't seen the first one in this series it will be linked up top and down below but this time around we're doing David Diggs he is a star was one of the stars of Hamilton that was on Disney if you haven't watched it he's also in a super cute Sesame Street DoorDash commercial which I think is just lovely um, I am a big fan of this space uh, I'm really excited to share this one um, I think you guys will really enjoy this one too this is like speaking to my whole style so let's dive right in First of all, love her outfit so much. It, this Watching this again is reminding me to go look for this online somewhere because I need this two piece in my life. His two actually. Yes, oh, love it. The kitchen, oh, love it already. They have done a lot in two years. Already it's just like color, color, color and we love it. I will admit though, I do not love the hanging chairs. I understand that they kind of have this like boho kind of situation going on. I'm just not a fan of the hanging chairs, but I understand where the desire comes from. Like, Amy, she's also an actress as well. And I remember when I watched this, the first, ooh, look at the back of that dress. Oh, love this so much. I remember when I watched this the first time, I did look her up and she was in something. I think she's in the um, Umbrella, what's that show called? Umbrella the Umbrella Academy. Pretty sure she's in the Umbrella Umbrella Academy. So like she's a great actress in her own right. Emmy um, Lamp. She says her last name uh, as we Funny move forward. For but so these baskets the already. Years, Boom. Emmy would just in my in my heart. Full of baskets. <laughs> and then a couple minutes. I later, love I this idea. Lamp. We see so many like basket walls where it's just like. A grouping of baskets doing this, which, if I'm honest, I don't always love. It's one of those things that's like somebody did it, put it on Pinterest, and then everybody did it. But the way that she has them kind of up this wall and around the windows, love. Chef's kiss. She is me. I'm going to stop doing something and then I'm going to keep doing that thing. Just in case you didn't know. I agree. It's weird that they have this um, picture, but also it's like, whatever, it's your home. Do what feels good to you. Here she is talking about her dad, Lampman. Emmy Lampman. That's her name. Also love her earrings. Sanctuary, you will. So this was an incredible So like, yes, the exposed wine cellar under the stairs is like, I can imagine that they yes, saw a lot of those and then they turned it into this little music space, which, I mean, I guess if he's, uh, well, uh, let's assume that they have like the sound wired throughout the entire home. But if he only has to listen to the music in there, I mean, I guess it's fine. But also like open the door, let us hear the music. But like, what a cute use of the space. And then eventually I'll post something. I just, the player, but it's the best. I feel like Sean would love something like this, this because you guys know if you've watched one of our videos that like he loves house. records. Now, this is the one point in the home that I'm not into. I hate these chairs at this dining table so much. <laughs> I hate Before them anything else had moved, so much. Up. So for they are just this like huge velvet, like, I don't know. They just feel very like, um, so we these chairs just feel very like, I don't know. They just feel um, a little more glam, I guess, maybe. 
is what's happening. They feel a little too glam for the space. I understand, like, it matches with the chandelier. kind of has this, like, gold vibe. Um, but, yeah, and they go on to talk about how much they use them. But, like, they feel too big for the table. I just don't love these chairs. I just don't love these chairs. I also think they would benefit from a larger piece of furniture in that dining room. Like, they look like they have just, like, a little... Um, console table back there and I think a larger piece of furniture in their dining room like a real sideboard or buffet would just be a little bit nicer um yeah we do it dining room's all not my fave yes. and this is how you um, have to and this built in is also like <laughs> I get it I love this couch this I understand couch the need but it's just again not my favorite room. this couch this though this like kind of sunken living room vibe that this couch is giving couch love is I mean, we live in New York and we have a couch, but maybe they are talking about, you know, smaller spaces. I don't know, but you can have a couch in New York City for sure. <laughs> and what a cool idea to have this custom ottoman made from a rug that the mom um, gave them. Love that. First of all, you guys know I love picking up things on my travels, and I just think that that's a fantastic idea. Because, yeah, you might end up with too much stuff that you just can't find a place for. And this is a great idea. I can See, like this piece that they have right here, this little this console table might look better in the dining room. <laughs> so, <laughs> now, this wallpaper is very is cool, and there are some by, uh, other um, other people I have seen making very similar wallpapers. Like there's a Brooklyn one that I've seen. Um, it was in Danielle's home tour. It is on our channel. I'll link it down below. So I think that's really cool. And I also think powder rooms are a great place to do something bold like this to do like a bold fun wallpaper in the powder room is like perfect because like she goes on to say everybody who comes into your home is going to go into that powder room um and what a way to make a like wow impact i think the ad styling in that bathroom though because you know ad added those little purple flowers was a little too on the nose we could have done something a little nicer but again we see the oranges with the leaves still on it like we know what ad is doing <laughs> but i love this kitchen so much love this tile i get what she was saying about the kitchen not being her um her vibe and how they changed it these brass open shelves we see open shelving all the time that is wood it's like a very like standard thing but these brass shelves are so nice and they look so good against this like black and white what i'm gonna guess is a cement tile and they still added in the wood but i this kitchen is like yes love I don't cook, so I don't know if it looks good for cooking, but it looks good for videos and photos. <laughs> yes, you go, bosses. Oh, love this. Because this is like fun vintage things. Old clock in car, a clock in time clock. That's what I'm trying to say. And this cool idea that they have that their friends come over and clock in. So we love that. Now I need one. Found. Now I need a vintage uh, and now clock. When we have a and way to go, Emmy, painting these slashes on the wall. <laughs> there is, I've seen wallpaper that's very similar, but if you didn't want to do that, you could totally take the time and do this. Oh, love the like vintage um, Nigerian barbershop art on the wall. Saw that. Their art, I haven't even talked about it, but the texture and art. Oh, this runner of the multiple rugs together. Love, 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 love. But the artwork that they have, their walls are full of very cool, interesting, like Afrocentric um, art. Love. And I was at a flea market with a friend. I was in and was a London in a flea market. Coffee bags. And they picked up and these they were all, coffee you know, bags. And like, all what a fun story. That is what I like, love is like, let's be able to tell like a fun, so interesting fun story about the things After in our home. Back, was like, oh, let me Look at this. Check. And she... Wow, what a lovely story. Welcome. 
love this wallpaper. Definitely. Look at this wallpaper. <laughs> love it. It reminds me of the wallpaper, similar to the wallpaper we put in our bathroom. No, we don't have time for accent walls. We need all the walls with the wallpaper. Pretty sure that lamp is from a Target um, collection. Love that lamp. Um, again, all the texture with the pillows. Love, love, love. Yeah, the guest room is like fine. Oh, this like is this wallpaper? Can't tell. But home for a lot of our friends. Yeah, you can tell that this room is kind of like where they kind of put some like extra furniture pieces. Ooh. And she's making macrame. Come on, quarantine crafts. Yes, quarantine crafts. This is a girl after my own heart. I want to be her friend. This is where you can tell that we're talking to two actors. It's like I mean that she goes to sleep and I agree. Yes. But they are they seem lovely. Love this chair in the corner. The bed. Okay, a little bit boring, but yes with the texture. Amazing bed that I Absolutely yes with the texture, but you know, I guess in a home, and everybody doesn't have to feel this way. Everything doesn't have to be like to the max, you know. But I love this these sandwich photos. I have gone and followed the artists on Instagram. They're like shop that sells these because I just and I haven't purchased one yet because I can't figure out what I want. But each time something culturally relevant happens, they make another sandwich. Like they put little Nas X on a sandwich. Um, and I just, well. yeah, I'm, I'm like, going to get one. Like love this chair. This chair is so good. <laughs> yes, love these so chairs. I'm going to check the description of this video and see if they mention where they, they get are. these chairs from. And they're also because so and this I want is a, one. This is a good reading moment. This is, I think, also this is another built-in, and I'm just like, hey, maybe. maybe I don't like built-ins. Maybe I'm against built-ins. I totally get it, though. They work for storage. Well, you know, if you live in California and you're a celebrity, <laughs> you gotta have a pool. It's his favorite it's a long spot. Trip. It's, like it's his and Luna's favorite spot. Pool. This is mostly where I am. I uh, I'm only wearing clothes because you're yeah. Here. If I was a California living suit. celebrity, I would have a pool too. And this is a cute little outdoor space. We cannot be mad at this. I feel like AD probably propped this space pretty heavily. I mean, I wonder how many pillows and throw blankets and and things like that they have out there regularly because it feels heavily propped <laughs> because it feels disjointed it doesn't feel as um culturally layered as the inside um so i wonder if maybe they hadn't gotten around to like fully styling that space yeah love this home so much except for those chairs AD. Also, I maybe I don't love his hair. Very busy schedule. Love hers though. <laughs> I gotta go lie down. And her outfit. Thank oh, you guys. You ain't need to say nothing about the man hair. I'm sorry. I, his hair is just so like. We, we, we gotta support black people. I am supportive. I am supportive. I just might not love his hair. <laughs> All right, that was David and Emmy's space. And really, was this video just a big love fest? Except for those chairs in the dining room. It was just like, those chairs are so big. I just don't think they work. But all in all, I think Emmy did a lot. I mean, she's obviously, she's an actress. She's not an interior decorator. And that home is lovely. It's beautiful, so layered, so textured. Like, yeah, if they rented it out for Airbnb, I would gladly stay. I want to be Emmy's friend. I want to know where she got this dress from. I want to know where David's two pieces from. Well, I think it's Louis Vuitton. I want it. I want several things. I want it all. Love, 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 love. All right, that was a big love fest. That's okay. I feel okay about that. If you guys loved it, hated it, how do you feel about those chairs? Let me know down in the comments below. Let's discuss. And if you have any other spaces that you think we should do, please leave those down there as well. Thank you as always for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.